Oh, this is Poppy. He's on Beast Miles. It's uh, for kids. You look like the type of kid that likes adventure. Maybe you'd like to join us on an alien hunt. Like and subscribe. Our people come to your house. Griffin's upset because he knows we don't have any kind of spaceship yet that can travel into outer space. So what are we going to do? My hunt hat isn't going to help me in outer space. We need a plan. We're going on an alien hunt. It's going to be a big one. It's going to have big alien eyes. I'm not scared. Are you? If you want to explore space, you gotta build a wall for A what? A wall for What's that? My friend. Poppy says we need to put together this rover. <laughs> What's his name? Poppy. He's my friend, so I get to open him. Well, we just came with this big pan. All right. So I got the rest of them. <gasps> there is a blast, so I don't know if I can build it. You might need some help. Wow. Yes, you are doing it right. And also, I have a much test now. Nice. Is there a drill on that? Yeah. Sweet. We have exactly half of a Mars rover. Done with this surgery. Hi. Hi. Grippy. Ready and lift off. As the countdown to Mars continues, the perseverance of humanity launching the next generation as we proceed towards uh, orbit and then towards. Uh, Mars destination. Yeah, absolutely. The velocity. Our current velocity is 440 meters per second at an altitude. Heat shield set. Perseverance has now slowed to subsonic speeds, and the heat shield has been separated. 2.6 kilometers from the surface of Mars. We have confirmation that the back shell has separated. After a long flight through space, our rover lands on Mars. Oh no! It's a space room. We can't go under it. We can't go over it. We just have to go through it. Mars is famous for its dangerous sandstorms. In fact, it's one of these storms that took the rover Opportunity offline. Going on an alien hunt. It's gonna be extraterrestrial. I got my unidentified flying object. I'm not scared. Are you? Go over it. 
Engage the thrusters! Engage the thrusters! Oh my goodness! What's that up in the sky? Did you know that many scientists believe that the universe is so large it must contain extraterrestrial alien life? Wait a minute, is this one of them now? Hey, before you go, don't forget to click like, subscribe, and ring my bell. Come on, I'll ring my bell. Yeah. What's up, zombie fam? So, from here on out, if you stick around after the credits roll, you're going to get a little something special. Might be a, uh, like, clue about an upcoming episode. Might be a blooper. Might be some vlogging or something, but you'll get a little something special. So stick around, and here's our first one. All right, so Kelly, can you tell us about Poppy and Oppie? Uh, do you remember when she got so excited about the Rover opportunity? Yes. Um, so... I feel like it correlated too with like where things were in Poppy's preschool because mm -hmm. I think they were learning about space. They talked about, you know, going to different planets, but Poppy really bonded with the story of Oppie. I mean, come on. The Mars names. Rover well, Opportunity. Listen to the names. Poppy, Oppie. Their names rhyme, Poppy, Poppy. right, right. Yeah. So, anyways, we were like ordering books on space, the planets, uh, you know just what it, what it means to go on a rocket ship. She was listening to that pot, like a podcast about being in space. Right. But uh, she got really devastated when she heard the news that Oppie w got caught in a, in a storm. And well, the last words were, my battery is low, it's getting dark. I mean, she would just, she would cry and cry. Uh, it was, it was, it really moved her. And I think the idea of space, like, well, Brock, you can attest to this. You really push, like, the idea of, you know, we need to get to space. Right, we need to go right. to space. Yeah, <laughs> always. So, you know, this was like, I think her seeing that dream through, like, this was our chance. And yeah, yeah. And now Oppie's not okay. But it's all right. It's all right, because this week, the space rover Perseverance landed on Mars, and who knows? Maybe it will find Oppie and fix her battery. Hopefully. Stranger things have happened.